So I'm the kind of guy who just loves collecting any kind of gadget, whether it be some kind of a mobile, whether it be some accessories, whether it be this particular flashlight. The only reason I particularly bought this one because it had a nice look to it. It was like a tactical professional lighting manufacturer. So I already have a gazillion of these flashlights, you know, in all shapes and sizes, but yet I wanted to buy this one. I'm also the kind of guy who will love his Swiss Army knives, you know, and I will not go anywhere without these. Trust me, even though I have absolutely zilch usage for them. So that was about me, rather. And uh, this particular video is not about flashlights or about the Swiss Army knife. So we'll just keep that aside. This particular video is about the Zippo lighter. Did I? Yeah, I placed that correctly. So this is about the Zippo lighter and my collections of them. So this is the original Zippo lighter. This is a first copy and this is a simple knockoff of the Zippo lighter. So as you can see, I have one or two others also lying around, but uh, unfortunately for this particular video, I couldn't really place them. I couldn't find them. I, I wanted to show you. I have probably about 10 or 15 of these Zippo lighters and believe me, it's not a joke. Okay, so I have them lying around everywhere. That's how much I am fond of useless uh, stuff and it's not like I have money to throw it's just I have this fetish or you know some, you can call it whatever you may want now the only problem with these Zippo lighters is that they run out of fuel very very fast so whether you have the first copy one whether you have the knock off one they will all just run out of fuel very fast it's practically like you have to fill them up every single day if you want them you know to last the full day so that was a real troublesome one so i also have the disposable lighters basically uh which are kind of use and throw ones I don't know you get them for a dollar or some couple of cents but the feel of the Zippo lighter I mean just like you know flipping the lid open and just swiping down you will not get that in those disposable lighters so keeping these two aside because we are going to compare the Zippo one with this now this is a rechargeable electric lighter but i don't know this is not like one of the ones that you have probably come across i came across it when i was just browsing through banggood.com so i'll just leave a link down below and you guys can check that out if you are interested so let's just open this up this is the box that it comes in this is the original zippo box and this is uh the electric uh, usb lighter so let's just open this up okay we have some kind of an instruction manual just discard that aside and this is the lighter just check out the shine on this metal body that it has it has a nice solid feel to it it's got these four buttons here four led lights sorry and it's got this one button here so basically and it's got a is that yeah that's a micro USB charging slot uh, there should be a cable also uh, where, where is the box there should be a charging cable if I'm not mistaken oh yeah so we got a charging cable as well the micro USB charging cable so let's just keep all these things aside and let's talk about this particular lighter here so these are supposedly uh, battery level indicators each one denotes 25% so if only one is lit that means it's 25 then it's 50 then it's 75 and then it's fully charged it goes like that so it's a flip one you flip that open and you get all these four lights charged up and blinking and then you simply just oh my god just look at that that is so ultra cool that is so ultra cool now it's got an auto shut off so as you saw that after a couple of seconds it will automatically shut off that's primarily i believe 
to prevent the battery drainage so that is an awesome feature and I just love I'm getting the original snap clicky snap feel with the Zippo uh, lighter that I love yet there is absolutely no uh, you know hassle of fueling it up or running out of fuel when you really need it because with this one I have filled it up uh, with fuel right down here and what really happens is if I'm going out to a party at night and in case I forget you know I filled it up right in the morning and what really happens is when you really need it it just does not work it just does not work because the fuels all dried up it's all consumed and the, it simply will not work so this was really really frustrating while this on the other hand you get the same snap here just just listen to that how cool is that how cool is that okay this one is definitely cooler but then you got to compromise some to get some that's my motto yeah so learn to live with that just look at this and then you just press this button here and it lights up so let me just show you guys so you have these four arcs here they're not hot right now they will not be hot and it's they apparently generate some kind of electricity which crisscrosses and uh, that's how you get the electrical spark here it's just like one of those electrical uh, kitchen lighters I would say kitchen stove lighters I would say that uh, let's just test it out let's try I mean its whole purpose is to light a cigarette <laughs> in case you guys do not know but let's just see whether this particular thing can catch fire using the electrical uh, chargeable USB lighter whatever you may want to call it uh, let's go oh my god it's catching fire and it's catching fire beautifully it works it works you don't have the unnecessary long flame for an emergency situation this will work and just look at the finish of this guys this is it has a solid heavy feel to it in fact it's heavier than this one so you will always always notice that you're carrying this while this is absolutely lightweight now whether that's an advantage or whether that's a disadvantage that's a very personal perspective but this has a solid durable feel to it and just check out the metal finish quality it's I don't know if you can make out into the vid in the video but it's like a dark brown chromish finish to it that's what I really loved about this one and you guys can just go ahead if any of you are into collectibles or if you are into uh, you know smoking so you can just go ahead and order one of these uh, there are many other types of these electrical uh, these rechargeable lighters also available but this particular product is by far the most uh, closest that you will find that comes to a Zippo lighter in itself I really loved this product and I just wanted to share that with you guys so if you like this one go ahead and guys please 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 I keep saying this at every in every video please do share a comment please do give me a feedback please hit that like button whatever hit that dislike button heck for all that I care just tell me that you are alive and you are out there okay so that is it for this particular video uh, the battery uh, life apparently see I haven't really checked out uh, in terms of like you know how many hours of usage will this really give you but it I have been using it since the past three days or so and uh, I've not faced any problem so this should be perfectly fine for a couple of days uh, do remember that you know it's got this built-in timer thing so the charge will not last beyond uh, more than a couple of seconds I think it's about five seconds I haven't timed it you can I love the sound of it that slight his sound that's so super awesome that's so super awesome I just love that 
I think this is in better focus and you can just have a look at the flame. Let's look at top side now. So we have these four uh, points here which will produce that electric uh, flame. Just look at that, just look at that. And the sound of it, it's a slight crackle crackle sound. I just love this, I just love this and I hope you guys do so too. Uh, do share your love by uh, liking this particular video or by hitting the subscribe button whatever suits your fancy that's it for now and i'll come back with another unboxing